Mission de la Fia, what up everybody? This is your favorite conquistador back with another video. Um, so I recently had a Yawo of Ochun hit me up and um, and so I just felt inspired to do a song for Ochun. And you know, whether or not, or oddly enough, the Ochun videos seem to be the ones that people really gravitate towards. You know, she's super duper popular, um, Orisha. Um, oh, by the way, before I start, uh, definitely if you haven't already, check out the trailer to the Babanoye video. It should be my last post. And um, and just in general, all the songs, I go into my channel and click on playlists, and you'll see a long list of Orishas, some that I have done videos for, a lot that I have not done videos for. Excuse me. And if I have not done a video for that particular Orisha and you want to learn a song, for that Arisha, then comment in the comment section below and let me know, hey, I want to see a song for Dada. I want to see a song for Oge, Oine, whoever. Um, so yeah, but the Babalu Oye video is on the way. And of course, you know, subscribe, ring the notification bell, let me know what else you want to hear, okay? So, like always, this is my source. Oh, and I actually, I got the, finally got the third edition in the mail of uh, this book, Orino Disa, Songs for the Selected Heads. I have the first edition, lost my second edition, went back to the first edition, and was waiting for this one in the mail. So, this song, um, for those that have the book, the third edition, I'm sorry it doesn't apply for the people that have the first and second, this is on page 410. I repeat, 410, 410, okay? Song number 22. For Ochun, okay? So like always, sing at a regular speed, slow it down, get my notes at the bottom, same thing, different day, okay? So, it goes like this. Beoni ha bebe osun, beoni ha bebe eda, beoni ha bebe osun, beoni ha bebe eda, ia yomu sakara reba. Beoni a bebe osun. I slow it down. And let me put. Let me just put this here. Neda. I'll explain that, okay? I know it's chicken scrap, okay? I'm gonna slow it down. Beoni a bebe osun. Beoni a bebe yenda. Beoni a bebe osun. Beoni a bebe yenda iya yumu sakala reba beoni a bebe oshun. Okay, so I definitely want to make sure I hit all the notes because um, this particular song, uh, for reference, definitely look up, like go on YouTube and type in um, Okan, O K A N, Okan, para, P A R. P A R A para Ochun O S O S H U N. I'm gonna put it in the description box below, and you're gonna hit the 12 minute mark, and that's where you can hear the song. The way they sing, I'm gonna sing it once just because it's a little complicated. Um, not very different, but I'm gonna sing it the way they sing it because the way it's sung in the book is different. So there are, I would say, a, a total of three renditions for this song. Okay, so the way they sing it in the uh, in that video. They're singing, Beoni a bebe osun, Beoni a bebe leda. Beoni a bebe osun, Beoni a bebe leda. Ia yumu sakala reba, Beoni a bebe osun. Um, the way it said in the book, if I take this away, it would actually be, I'm gonna take this away. The way it's said in the book is like this. And of course, translations and all the right wording and everything in the description box below. Okay, so the way it's said in the book, uh, what was it, page uh, 410? It's Beoni a bebe You say that twice. Ia yunu bara la reba beonia bebe osun. So just keeping that in mind, you know, I always like to give you guys the the different variations, you know, what the book says, 
what maybe you know all the different renditions um, and the interpretations of the same song. So this is what the book says. Um, a third, it's also in the book, is um, uh, let me see. Yeah, you know. It also says, Yeah, you know, cacalareta, cacalareta, instead of baralareta. So the way in the YouTube they say, sacalareba, sacalareba. In the book, option one, baralareba. Option number two in the book, cacalareta. Um, so take your pick. The translations change. Um, so I'm going to go down here, uh, in the YouTube video of Ocal para Ochum, they say Abebeleda, instead of Abebeleda, they say Abebeleda. An actual full translation I do not have, um, but I can make an inference. If Abebe means the practitioner, or no, I'm sorry, the petitioner, the petitioner, like to petition some, the petitioner, um, here it says, uh, Abebe, Abebe Yeda, the petitioner suitable by nature. I'm making an inference here saying that Leda is show for Eleda. Eleda means the head. You have Ori, which is the physical head, and your Eleda, which is like your crown head. Oh, my crown is Ochun, my crown is my Eleda Jemaya. Um, and there's also another way, I think, Alagba uh, Tori. I think that's another way of saying crown, but don't quote me. But the inference that I'm making from here, Abebeleda, the petitioner of the head. Um, in the YouTube video, they say, Ia Yumu, Y-U-M-U. Yeah, Y-U-M-U, Yumu. I believe that's a path. Um, Ibu Yumu. Uh, but don't quote me, you know, because I have to go with what I hear and also what I see in the book. Um, so in the book, you knew. In what you hear in Okan para Oshun, you move with the Um In the YouTube, they'll say Saka instead of Bara. And over here, you'll have Kaka. So, you know, I, I don't know, like which one you go with. Um, the safe bet is to go with what they're saying. Um, so, Saka, uh, Saka la regba, Bara la regba. You know, so go with what you feel is right. Again, I'm going to write down all the options and have all in the, the translations as much as I can in the description box below. Um, yeah, that explains everything. Um, I personally have never heard, um, and you know, the difference between and is literally four letters. You know, so take your pick. Uh, that's it. I'm going to, uh, actually, I'm going to, no. Yeah, okay. Bayoni. Uh, it, talk, it talks about the crocodile and how it's one of her messengers. Um, so I'm going to sing it again. I hope it wasn't too confusing. I'm going to sing it again at regular speed, the different versions. Okay, so you can hear them straight through. It's going to be a long one, okay? So, from the top. From, I'll do the first, the YouTube version, and then the book versions, okay? So from the version, Okan para Oshun, definitely look it up on YouTube, around the 12 minute mark. You can just click 12 on that. Um, it's a long video, it's like 30 minutes or something like that, so definitely look it up. It's a really, really good song. Um, so, let's start. Beoni a bebe Oshun, Beoni a bebe Leda, Beoni a bebe Oshun. Beoni a bebe leda, ia yumu saka la reba. Beoni a bebe osun. Now the book version. Beoni a bebe osun. Beoni a bebe yeda. Beoni a bebe osun. Beoni a bebe yeda. Ia yunu bara la reba. Beoni a bebe osun. One more time, the last one. Beoni a bebe osun. Beoni a bebe yeda. Beoni a bebe osun. Beoni a bebe yeda. Ia yunu kakalareta. Beoni a bebe osun. That is all three that you got just right there. Um, I guess the last note that I can say is, you know. Here it's written um, Osun, 
like I say usually like all my Ultron videos, you know, this is the correct way to spell it. I know there's like a, uh, let me look it up. I want to make sure I'm not steering you guys wrong. There's, you know, the, the, the correct Yoruba way of spelling the word. Okay, here we are. So the correct way of spelling Ochun would be this. It's got a little line here. It's got a dot here. And it's got a dot here. Yes, that's it. So keep in mind, in some versions when you hear, even look at me, they say Osun. Not to be confused with Osun. Osun is the rooster thing, the rooster head. When you get your warriors, the rooster metal thingy. Not to be confused with that. So there's Osun and there's Osun. So this would be Osun. Um, in Lukumi we say Ochun. So you can say Beonia Bebe Ochun. Beonia Bebe Osun. Beonia Bebe Oshun. Oshun, Ochun, Osun. In this, in the Okampara Oshun, they say Osun. And there are some songs where they do say Osun. But they're, you know, but they really mean Ochun, Oshun, whatever. Same way you're talking about the Orisha, the river deity. Um, and the last thing I forgot to mention that in the YouTube video, they also have the way you'll hear it. If you do look it up, it sounds like Bero, Beroni, Abebe Osun, Beroni, as if there's an R there. Um, that's just, I don't know. Beoni, that's the correct way. In local meat, at least the, this this particular version, they say Beroni. Um, I would say the Beoni, but I always like to give you guys the, you know, all the options and you listen to them for yourself, you practice them yourself, and you go with what feels right. And you go with what's more common. So the next time you go to Tambor and you hear the song, which version are, are they using? Are they saying Beroni or are they saying Beoni? Are they saying Abebe Ochun? Abebe Osun? Abebe Oshun? Are they saying Balalarekba? Or are they saying Sakalarekba? Or are they saying Kakalarekba? You know, so, you know, I give you the tools and you go, you know, make sense of it okay so i hope it was very informative you know this was a lot but um you know definitely practice the part where i did all three and go over it again and again like i always say in the description box below okay so thank you bendicion el conquistador over and out